Hi folks, uh, I just want to throw a quick video together on uh, how to do assignment 10 and 11. Um, so what I've done, if you read the assignment, it says you want to talk about absolute coordinates. So I've got the two screens up on here and absolute coordinates are the actual coordinate of the information. So if I look at this, point A would be at position 3, 1, point B at position 4 over 4 up, 1, 2, 3, 4 up. Position C would be 7 over and 5 up. So it tells you to put them in here. I want you to put them in an Excel spreadsheet instead. So I've made an Excel spreadsheet and I just put assignment 10 up there and I put the point and coordinate X, coordinate Y and then I just put in the coordinates of them. So A, B, C, etc. You can fill that all in as you go. Right, type your letters in, etc. Um, and then type your values in and carry on. That's pretty straightforward. Absolute is your absolute position. If you go to the next assignment, which I went full screen. Sorry, wrong button. I might have frightened you. Uh, if I go to the other assignment, which talks about relative points, in a relative point one, I went, instead of passing all your assignments in uh, individually, put them all in one spreadsheet. So just add a new sheet when you need a new sheet. Right, so I added a new sheet and I renamed it uh, by clicking on here and calling it rename. So I renamed it A11, which makes sense to me. So if I can go to A11, I put in the values. So if you look at your table that it wants you to fill in, it looks like this. So Rx is the relative X and the Ry is the relative Y coordinate. So positions in relation to where they end up compared to where they start. And then these polar distances. So that's how far it is. And this is your angle. So if I look at the first one, if I go back up, if I look at the first one, the it's from starting at zero, zero, how far did I go over to get to the next point? Going, uh, what's this say? Go clockwise. And go clockwise, start at zero. So I put the wrong values in. So I start here and I go up uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. So that's eleven up. So the relative coordinate, and if this is my zero, zero, then this is, um, zero in the x direction and 11 in the y direction then this resets and becomes zero so the next one would be how far does it go this way so it goes over five in the x direction and zero in that direction and then the polar part is what is the length of it so this is like vectors for those of you taking physics the length of that is 11 and the angle is 90 degrees because you have to go straight up then the next one would be five and zero degrees and the next one for this would be two and then you go down so it's gonna be 180 no nope, sorry 270 and so each of these points is how far you go assuming this becomes a zero point again so then for this you would go uh, zero over and uh, negative two because you went down two. so hopefully that makes sense uh, the last one is assignment 12 And assignment 12 is the same idea. You're filling that in again. So hopefully that makes sense. I'm sure most of you have a handle on Excel, but just to check on it. And because it's the same thing, if you go to this, if I go up in the corner and I go to this spot and I hit uh, Control C, then I should be able to paste it in the next one. and then change your numbers. Hopefully that helps, hopefully I can figure